Okay, hello everyone. So this video is here to help you guys um, fix the issue with uh, Call of Duty not opening or it's like not working. Ah, that's just a notification. So yeah, um, first of all, I will show that my game is working fine. All right, let me get inside the game. So well, at least it opens up. You can see here. All right, and then well, it passes through the screen and all, and then gets inside the game. I'll show until that. Yep. I'll just cut out the portion of my account login because I don't want to show that. So there we go, we are inside the game, and yeah, it's working fine. And I have played the Battle Royale and multiplayer just yesterday, and they were working quite fine, and the smart controls were all working quite fine and all. So I don't really know if um, something is wrong um, with the smart controls itself. I mean, they were working quite pretty fine for me. So yeah, now I will be going over to the Bluestacks control settings, because I think that uh, the issue might be there with your um, Bluestacks, alright? So over here you can go and click in these three lines, which is menu, and then you can come here and click on settings. After that, uh, well, you have to select the one which you here, which is your um, resolution. For me, it's 1080p. So I have gone over there and selected it. All right, the graphics is auto. Let it be auto. All right, and then you you come over here and select on the engine. After that. Try to see if, if this is um, same as yours, alright? I try to uh, keep it on medium and then RAM is high. Then graphics engine should be performance, so don't change it, alright? If it's changed in compatibility, just change it to performance, alright? And then after that, re graphics renderer, set it to OpenZL. And then you need to have a good GPU, alright, to run this game or else it is it, it will lag and probably because you don't have a graphics, maybe that's why it's not opening up. So for me, it's my I have a 1050 Ti, so that's why I have selected this box, and it will use the 1050 Ti for the um, GPU, right? For the graphics processing and all, and then set it to disable ASTC. Don't change that. Frame rate is 60. Well, you can also enable high frame rates, and well, I I have it disabled. 60 is quite fine. It's smooth, and yeah, try to make sure that every every of the settings are same as mine. Well, this should probably fix some of the well issues if you are having. Try to make sure that your graphics renderer is OpenGL and the GPU is set to the, the preferred dedicated computer graphics, alright? After that, you come over here, there is the device, okay? After that, in the device, choose a predefined profile here. Make sure that you are select, you have selected OnePlus 3T. Well, for me, OnePlus 3T is working fine, alright? So don't go ahead and select something else like uh, Samsung something or something yeah samsung galaxy s10 or something this should be fine all right one plus 3d just go over there i mean it's working fine for me so make sure that you are ha well, you also have one plus 3d maybe it should work out and help you all right and mobile network provider for me i'm in i'm in india so i'm, I'm using the vodafone all right so try to make sure that all of these are selected and then click on save don't forget to save all right so that should be it for the video i think it should help you if you are having some kind of glitches or something or like the game is not opening up or you just uh, even if you click on it just nothing happens you know well that is basically not opening up <laughs> all right anyways i will see you guys in the next next video then um hopefully this helped if you have any questions or some doubts you can ask in the comment sections below all right see you later